Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel. So, on today's video, we're gonna go check out our brand new property that we're under contract on. We're gonna go check out the 10 acres. My wife and I are gonna kinda plan out where the new pole barn's gonna go, where the new house is gonna go, and just talk about our plans with the property because we are beyond excited to be on this next adventure. So, stay tuned guys. Welcome back to the channel, everyone. So we are out in the middle, well, not even really the middle, but we're getting ready, we're walking down where the new driveway is gonna be on the 10 acres that we're buying. Um, you know, this property does have a house up front, but we plan to build out here in the back. Um, that'll probably be a year and a half-ish, but our barn, we're looking for a place to put that up right away. So if you are new to this channel, um, let everybody know who you are down in the comment section. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button so that you get notified when we put videos out. And we're going to keep bringing you guys value with overlanding, um, now building out our new homestead here, and yeah, just having fun. So, all right, so we are kind of in the middle ish of the property. And one of the reasons that we fell in love with this property is because you get about halfway back and there's a nice size hill that'll be absolutely perfect for a walkout. So right about here, we're about halfway back in the property. Um, there is a nice downhill section. So we're thinking the house is gonna go right here, kind of on an angle. So when you come down the driveway, you appear at the house. Um, and then you're gonna curve to the right and there's a section over on the other side that's actually already cleared and that's where we're thinking that we're going to put the pole barn. Um, part of the reason we gotta come out here and figure this stuff out right now is because the house is not gonna get built for probably a year and a half, two years. We're gonna do a remodel-ish of the house that's up front. We're kinda undecided whether we're gonna do uh, rental. It just depends on what's happening in a year and a half, two years. Um, but the pole barn is gonna get built right away. Obviously, we wanna build the pole barn back here because it's super nice and private. Um, so that's gonna get built right away. It's probably gonna be a touch annoying because it's gonna be a year and a half. You can't even see the barn from the house, but it's okay, because it's his future plan. So we're thinking clearing right about in here to put the pole barn. Um, our plans right now is a 40 by 40 pole barn, 16 foot high, so that we can put a loft in it. Um, possibly offices later on, not quite sure, but we wanna leave the option. Right now it's just gonna be the shell because lumber prices have skyrocketed, so I can't really afford to do more than just the shell and the doors. So super excited about that. Um, you know, I'm, I wanna bring all of that content to you guys, clearing the driveway, cutting all the trees down, getting the barn built, so that way you guys can see it going together. And we're gonna talk about all the pricing right now because lumber is up stupid high. But I want you guys to know, you know, what does it cost to build a shop these days? So, yeah, we're excited. So, one of the other things we're really, oh, catching my head. <laughs> Um, one of the other things we're super excited about this property, it already has trails all throughout it because the current owners have, have children that are riding snowmobiles and quads and stuff out here. So it's already set up with a trail system. So we're gonna be able to have a blast, blasting around here on quads. Um, you know, maybe we'll get some snowmobiles some days, who knows. Um, but our kids are going to be able to grow up here. They're gonna be able to ride around. We're gonna be able to pull them on sleds. You know, hopefully we can get our Huskies to um, not wander off so that they can play and have fun. Um, that'll be its own adventure, getting them trained up. But um, we're, just, we're just excited. I mean, their last house, as you guys know, only had about three acres and this one has 10 so it's gonna be a lot more acres to play and have fun on and it's also all dry so we don't have to worry about flooding or anything like that and the best part my wife loves this too natural gas so um, we're gonna be able to have a mini split in the barn instead of burning wood 
because we're not going to be spending a fortune to heat stuff. So that is going to be amazing too. Um, all in all, we're really excited. I'm um, excited to bring you guys kind of on this journey with us as we build this out. So um, if there's anything else you guys want to see, let me know. Otherwise, hope you have a great day and we'll talk to you soon.